Hi guys, this is Bonnie from Manhattan, New York. So I'm coming to you guys with a mini haul. So I purchased two of these Rainbow Nerds. And they were 49 cents on sale at Target. And they're usually like $3 a box. So that was super cool. From, I'm sorry, I said Target from Dwayne and Reed. And from Target, I purchased the new, from the new collection at Maybelline Matte Colors. 666. 660. Excuse me, guys. Touch of Spice. And this is how it looks like. It's a pretty, pretty color. I'm not going to swatch it because you guys know um, once you start to use the lipstick, even if you swatch it, that's when the expiration date starts. For those of you who didn't know that, just a fun tip. That's why a lot of my makeup, when I show you guys my unbox, it's not that I don't want to swatch it for you guys. It's just that, for instance, I had a... Um, I, my Sedona Lace makeup palette, I only opened one out of the two colors and I bought it for over a year now because once you swatch it, touch it, um, that's when the expiration date, for instance, if it, if it expires the next year, it starts to expire the next year. But as long as you don't swatch or anything, it doesn't expire yet or it doesn't say that it expired before that time. So I also bought from their MAC collection 650 Nude Embrace. As you guys can see, it says matte down there. And this is how that looks. You guys know I've been obsessing over nude colors. I've been going nuts. I've been loving nude colors. So I left work a little early, guys, because I am tired. I want to take a nap. And I, um, I tried to do a secret shopper thing and you, you guys had asked me if I was willing to try it and I did and they sent me a check for $997 and some cents and it turned out to be a um, fake a fake um, money order so if you guys try something like that just be extra careful yourselves as well um, also from Maybelline I tried the 690 Siren and Scarlet matte And this is what it looks like. And it seems like it was real. Oh, Lord. Somebody touched it. I try to look and make sure nobody didn't touch it, but that's how that looks like. And somebody touched it, if you guys can see how shiny it is. It's not like, it's not new. Can you guys see that? Okay, yeah, you guys can see it. It's not new at the top, somebody. There you go, you can see the scratches. Somebody already used it, but every girl needs a red lipstick. I own uh, about four red lipsticks in my collection, and I have a lot of makeup, guys. I also picked up 670 Ravish and Rose from their MAC collection as well. And as I told you guys before, what I love about Maybelline is that it's actually true to color. So whatever you see on the outside of the package, that is the exact color. Can you guys see this? That is the exact color that the lipstick itself is. I love that. Um, I found that when I used to wear Black Opal and L'Oreal and all those other colors, they are not true to color. The color that they would have on the bottom the color would be like two to three shades darker or lighter. And if you're a makeup artist like myself, you know, and what if you're doing a wedding or something and you need that person told you a certain color, you have to know your color tones, you have to know your color shades. And I guess I'll just spray that and sanitize it. But yeah, and then guys, I scored the last, the last blush nudes palette. And this came out last year, July, guys. But I had just bought the black one, so I just got my hands on this one, and this was the last one that Target had. And I had bought it already and returned it, so it wasn't um, something that I don't have in my makeup collection. I have these colors, but I'm not trying to downplay it at all. It's just that I had these colors already, and at the time, I was building my makeup collection from scratch. So I was trying to get every color, every single color. It, the step down from the color, so I'm still working on that now. I'm still trying to get every single color that there is right now. That's what I'm trying to do. So this is the Blushing Nudes by Maybelline. 
and this is how it looks. I think they have the smoky nudes and the blushing nudes. I have the other one as well. And if you guys remember, I showed you guys in my mini haul in July when I had bought it and I told you guys I was going to bring it back. I also paid $15 for it. And in Target, I only paid $10 for this palette. So, and then it came down to about $6.90. I think this palette came down to $6 when she rung it up. So that was super cool. And last but not least, I bought another e.l.f. powder brush number 84003 so i bought another one i really 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 like these brushes i've been using elf makeup since 2010 well earlier than 2010 i've been using elf makeup since 1998 so i love elf a lot um so guys stay tuned for my next video which is going to be what my 100 subscribers won. And hopefully next time I host a giveaway, you guys enter to win as well. Because I would love for you guys to win my giveaway. Um, the giveaway was once I hit 100 subscribers. Now I'm almost at 200 subscribers. I'm not going to be doing giveaways for every 100 subscribers. Because I can't afford the nice stuff that I want to give you guys for every 100 subscribers. Because that could be like in a day. You know what I mean? So what I'm going to do is when I hit 600 subscribers, I'm going to do another giveaway. So guys, stay tuned because the minute you see I have 600 subscribers, I'm going to be hosting a giveaway. So stay tuned. And then after the 600 subscribers, my next giveaway will be 1,000 subscribers. So guys, 1,100 subscribers. So stay tuned for that. I'm going to try to do a giveaway for every until... Two more giveaways before I hit a thousand subscribers, and then after a thousand subscribers, I, I'll let you guys know how I will be doing the giveaways. Thank you guys so much for subscribing to my channel, it means so much to me. Welcome to my channel. If you're new, you guys are making just a little girl's dream come true. I've always envisioned myself doing what I'm doing right now, being able to tell my story virally, let you guys know what goes on on a daily basis, what goes on in my life, and you guys. No, I live by myself with my cat. And um, you guys are basically my viral family. So without you guys, it wouldn't be possible. So I thank each and every one of you guys so much out there. Like, I had an awesome time at work. I feel like work is so stressful. And, and, and it's overwhelming. And it's just hard because it's not something that I would do if I had the choice. But yet, um, they had a picnic, and it just made it seem like everything just went away. Like, it just seemed like a peaceful, a peace, a calm just came through. And, you know, they fed me. And, you know, that's usually, unless I go on a date, that's the only other time somebody feeds me. So, that was so sweet and so sentimental. It may not mean anything to them because, like, oh, it's just a picnic or work. But it really meant a lot to me, and I had a lot of fun. But... Um, the interns that work at my at my job, they left, so they had a picnic for them, like a go going away party, and we all and all my me and my coworkers brought in dishes. Again, um, a lot of my coworkers that I work with is in a lot higher position than I am. I am a custodial, and they're like administrative and stuff like that. Um, so it's really a struggle when you're a mom like myself and you had kids at 15 and 16 and you're looking at people and that's where you're aspiring to be and they're like you know like your boss they're higher than you and they may not you know like value the position like it's like nothing but to you it's just like it, it's not a million dollars it's not super huge but it's just like damn how long is it going to take for me to get there especially if you're struggling like i am i really 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 feel like i'm struggling day to day but that will be another conversation for you guys. So, again, this is Brian from Manhattan, New York. Thumbs up this video. Share it, like it. Hit that subscribe button below. Leave your comments in the comment section below. Let me know what other videos you guys would like to see. And be blessed. I'll do the same. Even if you don't feel like thumbsing up this video or subscribing, just be blessed. Most importantly, mwah!